Hello everyone and welcome to the Canadian Redneck channel. My name is Dave and uh, today, being a nice December day, uh, you can see we've got some snow on the ground here and so on, I thought it would be a good time to talk about uh, glow plugs. Uh, specifically how to wire up glow plugs on uh, some of the old British internationals. In this case it's a P414. Um, there uh, tends to be some confusion and and so on about how they wire up properly and so I've got one here that uh, just finished the motor job on and uh, we'll be wiring the glow plugs up. We'll start out with uh, I've got a glow plug here to show you um, these wire in series there's two contacts in each glow plug it's the threaded portion here and the base portion here they do not ground through the case. The power has to flow in one contact and out through the other. Uh, I'll move the camera around here and we'll uh, see how they wire in. Okay, we've got a decent view of the side of the head now with the uh, glow plugs. Glow plug number one, glow plug number four. So the power comes in from the switch to number four, goes through all and grounds from number one at the front here. This uh, ground wire goes around and grounds to the front of the block. So the first thing, there's two wires with a larger opening and they connect number three and number four and number one and number two. And they go in on the bottom. Then you can put the little porcelain insulators on make sure that those stay down at the bottom and then there's one wire with the uh, smaller holes in it they go that goes on top of the porcelain insulators between number two and number three and then you put the threaded caps on on those two. Okay, and then we'll take our number one out front here, hook our ground wire on there, and the threaded cap can go in. Now you can put the power wire to number four, put your threaded cap on there. You gotta make sure that the uh, wires, the bottom wires, stay right in to the base. power comes in through the uh, threaded portion, the center portion of uh, number four, through the glow plug, out through the base contact, in through the base contact of number three, and out through the threaded uh, on it, in through the threaded contact on uh, number two, through the glow plug, out through the base, in through the base on number one, out through the threaded contact, and to ground. Gives you a completed circuit. If you're still having trouble with your glow plugs, you can. Uh, it, it's best not to use a test light because uh, glow plugs drown off amps that they'll usually they'll often blow the bulb in the test light. So just take a screwdriver and touch across the ground to see if you're getting power there. If you're getting power there, you move on to the next wire and short across the ground until you find one where you're not getting power. And if you're not getting power, say between number two and number three then most likely either your number three glow plug is bad or the contacts are dirty and it's not making contact through uh, but either way you can rectify the situation and uh, now that we've done that I will uh, grab a, a, a glow plug here and show you how to test it with a test light and a battery to see if you're getting continuity through the through the glow plug okay I've got an old battery here in the shop has some pal life in it. There you go, you can see the 
light light up. So your glow plug, just ground the threaded portion, and you touch the base portion there, power travels through that glow plug. Doesn't ground to the base. Check. Yep, doesn't ground it through the threads. That's what you're looking for. That should be a good glow plug that you can use. So that was a quick how-to on how to wire glow plugs. Uh, hope you enjoyed it, found it useful. Uh, as always, like, subscribe, share. Have a great day.